What's going on guys, Tmart here, and I'm bringing you another Jumps and Spots video, and today, as you can see, we're going to be taking a look at the map Bakara, or Bakara, I'm not really sure how you pronounce it, but uh, let's get started. So, uh, number one over here, we have A Domination, there's a ton of different capture spots, number one is right here. Also, you can get over on the other side of this corner, and then finally you can come over to this third corner. So you can really stay protected when you're capping that. You can also get on top of this crate by getting on this pile of rubble and then jumping to the oven and getting up on the crate. And uh, you can capture it from up here, but it's not very good because, I mean, <laughs> you have no cover. You kind of sit out like a sore thumb. So uh, that's really only if you know the enemies are going to be coming from around this corner. Now, uh, another good spot is the chopper here. So number one, you can actually shoot the turret on the chopper. I know that's probably a newbie tip, but I may have just blown some of your minds. I know a lot of people haven't really figured that out yet. As well as you can jump on top of the tail here and then jump to the body of the chopper. Or you can get on this little hill here and jump to the nose. And get up on top, then you, if you get on the rotor you can jump to this room here take any news by surprise a lot of people like to camp here and they sit here watching uh, the stairs and they might have a Betty at the bottom of the stairs or they may be camping looking out this window so you can really take some news by surprise using that Another good spot in here is there's actually a search and destroy bomb like right here where I'm aiming. It's just out of sight of this window. But if you hear someone defusing, you can cook a nade and bank it off the window and it's going to land right next to the bomb. So that's really useful. Now, one of the most useful tips for this map is what's about to happen. So... A lot of people think that the only way to get from one side of the map to the other on this side of the map is to run through this bucket room. So that's why a lot of people tend to camp it. They'll sit here and watch the doorway. They'll sit here and watch the doorway. They'll sit here and look through the buckets. They'll sit here and watch. You know, a lot of people tend to camp this. So what you can do to get around that is go around the ledge here. And uh, boom, look at that. Knife you in the back, camper, all day, baby. But uh, yeah, so that's really useful. You can go both ways. Uh, you can also go along this ledge here and get on the dumpster. I don't know why you would want to do that. It's not really that good. Uh, and then also, you'll notice some people camp behind this blanket here and it's the stupidest thing I've ever seen it makes you feel good because you know there's this nice little hole here just for you to see the middle of the map but if you really take a look at it the whole bottom part of your body is going to be exposed so uh look out for campers right there just want to let you guys know now uh we have one or a couple other spots on this map. Uh, there's one nice little line of sight to watch the entire back street, and that is right on the corner of this building over here. If you get up on this little pallet, you jump to the barrel and you get on top of the other barrel. You can see down the street here, and it's pretty good. I mean, you aren't fully covered, but uh, it does work pretty well and gives you a nice line of sight. Uh, you can also get up on these back stairs here, and you can look through the little grate, and you can see over into that other building. As people filter through that building, you can kill them. It's especially useful in headquarters because there's a headquarters capture point right here. And uh, that kind of leads me into the next spot. So when it's headquarters, the enemy team will set up like right here and they'll be watching this. They'll set up right here watching this. They'll set up in this corner and this corner. You know, they'll be all camped out in this building. And it's really, really hard to take control of it. So there's a couple different things you can do. Number one, there's a window slot right here. And this kind of reminds me of Villa. You can throw a stunner, a nade through there, come around and kill them if you want to. But you can also jump on top of this truck and then jump on top of the wall. You can kill anybody camping in this little area. You can kind of see through there to the doorway. And you can also look through this hole in the wall and kill anyone who may be camping there. Cook a nade, throw a stun, do whatever you got to do and take control of the building. It's super, super useful. Now, there's a capture spot for B domination, number one of which is pretty obvious. If you get along this wall here, you can kind of watch for people who may be coming around this direction. But the better one is if you have the C domination uh, spawn, you can come up and you can hop on top of the concrete mixer and you can get right here. And it's going to protect you from that car blowing up and no one really looks around this corner. So, uh, you know, that's pretty useful. Uh, and then finally, if you come over to the triangle stairs, there is a kind of little crack that you can look through. So if someone's camping on this side, or they may be waiting for you to come over or something like that. You can just look through this crack and take them out or you can look under the truck and take them out. And, uh, you know, that's pretty good. So, uh, anyway, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. Uh, you know, this map doesn't have too many things, but there are a couple of them that, uh, that are really going to help you out, namely the chopper here where you can jump into the window as well as going around this thing. So, uh, anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to uh, let me know and uh, I'll catch you all later. Uh, new video coming out soon. Can't wait to see you guys then. Check out one of the other two videos on screen if you uh, if you want to in the meantime, and I'll catch you all later, guys. Thank you. See ya.